Hi guys, Mohammad Saddam here from Stockmix. In today's session, we are going to discuss stock analysis on MCX. So before that, kindly pause the video and just go to this camera. Well, I'm using the TradingView platform. So here it is. So MCX, the stock which it is trading negatively, you can see uh, two days before the stock, it has been closed negatively by minus six percentage. And from then you can see it started consolidating, right? So let me go with the weekly time frame. So on a higher least time frame, you can see the moment of this. So the swing, it started from this level, which made a recent high. So this is the rejection zone and the swing low, which happened and pulled back and which rejected once again out of this place, right? So we got the swings and by drawing the diagonal line towards the upper side, we got the support area zone. And from the top level, we got the resistance zone as well. So it is very clear that stock it is it is in a symmetrical triangle chart pattern formation being the reason uh, you can see the rejection as well. So swing high and so swing high, swing low, swing high, and it has broken this support area zone. So we can look for the bearish trend in this as per the chart pattern. So stock it closed below the support line on a weekly time frame. So we are expecting. The stock gonna continue the downtrend once it touches the levels around 1344 and pull back and once again on breaking these support levels. So we can expect the stock may slide towards the range around 1156 rupees for the coming days. Right? Still, we have scope on this. So initially, we can look for 1344 levels on pullback levels. So once again, there is a chance that stock may the stock it may pull back and go towards the trend line levels and the second possibility in this case on sustaining above this the trend line so the action may change in this which will be looking for the breakout so that is above this levels we can look for the long side which is possible towards 1697 levels for the coming days so two possibilities in this case so we can look for the pullback levels and on rejection we can look for the downside 1156 levels only above 1536 levels, we can look for 1697 for the coming days, right? So just draw the lines in your chart and start tracking the MCX. So if you're not part of our Telegram channel, kindly subscribe for more analysis. So we used to be much active in our Telegram channel. So that's it for the day. We'll catch up with different stock analysis in tomorrow's session. See you then.